So something's on my heart to share in this moment with you all about working with your guides um, as a whole and working with your guides to receive healing. There are times when we know what we need, right? We have a very specific healing request or area of our life that we would like to receive guidance on. Got some questions. <laughs> so say, you know, your left knee needs healing. Your heart chakra needs healing. You need some guidance about your career space, for example. We have specific ways that we might desire to work with a guide, right? To protect our energy, to set the energy of our business, for example. But, you know, there are times when we think we know what we need, but in reality, we could benefit from much more than that or something other than that. And our logical mind is just revving up and can't quite wrap itself around the possibility of something different or something other. So it can be beneficial when working with your guides to just set a space of surrender and receptivity and just simply bring them into your awareness, into your space and ask for a healing. Just keeping it simple. Ask for the guidance that will benefit you the most in this moment and just be open, receptive in that state of surrender to what comes forward and sit with it. So the next time that you work with your guides, you know, check in with that still small voice inside you. Is this a time for me to be really pinpointed in how I work with my guides? Or is this a time for me to be more open and to be receptive? So that was just on my heart to share with you all and something that's really resonated with me in my practice as of late. 